Building a house is one thing, but you also need amenities such as electricity and water. We are building a house in Thailand and we are building a water tower. It starts by drilling a well. Forty meters deep, we find crystal clear water. Lowering a pump that deep is scary, but luckily we don't drop it. And then there is water. Next we cut all steel pipes and beams to the right length. Weld the two sides of the tower. In the meantime, another team digs and prepares the concrete foundation. Now it is time to put both sides up straight. Since we don't have a crane, we make our own from a tall tree and a car. Slowly our tower rises up to the sky. The scariest part is climbing up the wobbly tower to disconnect the tow rope. Then the second side goes up. Now it's just a matter of welding the two sides together to create one solid and rigid structure. A coat of paint finishes the steel construction. It is time to put the 1000 liter tank on the top of the 10 meter high tower. We made a small crane on the top to make this easy, or should I say, easier.
10 meters above ground, nothing is really easy. Connecting the plumbing is straightforward, but balancing 10 meters above the ground makes everything hard. All PVC pipes are covered by aluminium tape to protect them against the sun. And the electrical wires that go to the double redundant sensors are encased in flexible steel to prevent possible lightning strikes to travel through the wires into the main electrical system. Oh, no. oh,